We got to get justice for the shine. We got to get accountability. Yes. We got to get to the truth. Just hours ago, dozens rallied outside of the Fulton County Jail for former Fulton County inmate LaShawn Thompson, who died back in September while in custody. To LaShawn Thompson is a human rights violation. Civil rights attorney Ben Crump says while the cause of Thompson's death has not yet been determined, his cell was deplorable and he believes Thompson was neglected during the three months he was housed inside of the jail's psychiatric wing. The Fulton County Medical Examiner noted Thompson's cell had a severe bed bug infestation, which attorneys believe led to his death. Somebody is responsible for this inhumane death. During the more than hour-long press conference, a familiar face could be seen amongst LaShawn Thompson's family. We're going to have something unique, uh, a sheriff, an elected official who's willing to come and stand with the family and make a statement. This is absolutely unconscionable, yeah. point blank. In a move you don't see often, the Fulton County Sheriff Pat Labatt addressed media alongside attorneys and family. If holding people is, uh, accountable is a crime, I'll be guilty every day. The sheriff's appearance comes just 24 hours after the Fulton County Board of Commissioners approved $5.3 million in funding to help improve conditions at the jail. The sheriff's office has launched two investigations into Thompson's death, an internal one and one being conducted by the Atlanta Police Department. The family's attorneys say they plan on filing a lawsuit against the sheriff and detention officers once their own investigation is complete. In Atlanta, Brittany Klein-Peter, 11 Alive News.